Hi, today we're going to be doing the basic makeup uh, foundation actually. I'm going to show you what I do on an everyday basis just when I'm going to the grocery store or to get gas or anything like that. So this is very simple everyday foundation application. Um, later on I'll show you guys on another video I'll show you more elaborate makeup. This is just very basic. So I'm going to start off by applying a little bit of Burke Bees beeswax lip balm to my lips so my lips will be moisturized while I do my makeup. I've uh, realized that doing these video clips in 10 minutes is a little difficult so I'm going to try to go as quick as I can but I will do my best to make sure I tell you guys everything. Okay so what I'm going to be using today is Maybelline Mineral Power Foundation. I have this one in dark zero and medium number four. I'm also going to be using Makeup Forever Full Cover Waterproof Makeup. This is in eight and Makeup Forever Full Cover in 12. Obviously, use the color that best suits your skin tone. I'm going to be using my 187 brush by MAC and my 188 brush by MAC. Also, I'll be using the 217. Okay, so the first thing I do is take my number eight, the lighter color, Makeup Forever Foundation. I'm gonna apply this with the 217 to any blemishes that I have. A lot of blemishes. <laughs> I also use this down the bridge of my nose just a little bit just to highlight in the smile lines. Not to highlight the smile lines, this is going to conceal them a little bit. I like to go around the corner of my nose in case I have any redness, it's going to tone it down. Then I take the 12 Makeup Forever Foundation full cover. And this is what I use on the same brush, so I still have a little bit of the 8 on there. And I put it around my eyes in a horseshoe shape. So I go from the outer corner to the inner corner and just pat it on. I'm going to take the 8 again in the full cover foundation with the same brush 217 and just kind of dot a little bit down the center of my cheek right under my eye. Okay, so that's what that looks like before I blend it in. Just wiping off my 217 on the paper towel. Now I'm going to take my 188 and buff everything in, blend it in very very well. Now down the bridge of my nose, I'm not going to really buff it out too much. I'm just going to pat it a little bit because I don't want to take it away. If I blend it too much, then it won't serve the purpose. Just taking away any hard line, but not too much. Okay, now that I have concealed all of my blemishes, I don't have any dark spots showing, but I do have lighter patches that show. So that's what I want to cover up now, and I'm going to use my foundation to do that, to give me a nice, even complexion. So I'm finished using, I'm finished with the full cover foundation by Makeup Forever. And now I'm going to move on to using the Mineral Power in two different colors, one darker, one lighter. If you're ever in between foundation colors, if you're ever in between two foundation covers, take both, the darker and the lighter one because you could always mix them to make your perfect shade. So I'm gonna take the lighter color, medium four, and on my, 180, uh, my 186, 
actually 187, sorry. I'm just gonna put two, three little drops, two drops should be enough, right on the brush. And I dab it on my cheeks and blend it in the center of my face. Forehead, nose, cheeks, and around my mouth on my chin. Now with the same brush, the 187, I'm gonna take my Mineral Power in Dark Zero. This is the darker Mineral Power by Maybelline. I really like it a lot. And do the same thing. I'm gonna apply two drops, three drops, the same way we did earlier. And I'm gonna follow the outline of my face, just around the outer, the outer edge of my face, and I'm gonna blend that in. Now, I've done that, so what I wanna do now is with the very same 187, I'm not gonna apply any more product, I'm just gonna take the brush. Remember your brushes, when you use it for foundation, they always hold a little bit of product, so I'm gonna take the very same brush and just blend everything in so that there's no defined lines between the two foundation colors that I have so that everything looks nice and even. Little circles, just a buffing buffing motion. I find that to be the best way to blend foundation. Okay, so there we have it. That is my everyday foundation look. Um, of course, if you wanted to continue on to apply a little pressed powder to take away any shine, you do that. But this is how I apply my foundation for an everyday, clean, natural look. This is great for the summer and great for every day when you're in a rush. So, there it is. I'll see you soon. Kisses.